Hey guys, this is my video review of how to install a custom kernel on the Motorola Moto G XT1032. I guess it works on all the other variants of the Motorola Moto G and I'm gonna fa flash the experience kernel uh, which is the perfect kernel for stock ROM. Uh, there are many kernels available, Fox and but uh, uh, this experience kernel is said to be the best one because it provides a good battery life and double tap to allow the phone so let's check it out uh, I'll leave the link uh, link down in the description so just download it I have downloaded it already let me show you in the experience is to get a zip I hope you can see I'm in the phone closer So let's just uh, boot into recovery. Make sure your phone is rooted and CWM installed, uh, or you can just check it, check my other channel, and I'll show you uh, other video uh, regarding this how to fix the boot logo. Uh, in which you could see the warning bootloader logged and you can skip that and try the new one this one uh, stock Motorola so now just go to install zip you don't need to wipe any factory data reset or wipe cache partition uh, you just need to take the android backup in case you face problems with the rom or the rom doesn't work so just go to install zip and uh, uh, wherever your uh, downloader uh, uh, file is I mine is in download so I'll just go to download and the first one is that so let's just install it so install now let's just reboot the system the experience kernel logo I'm trying this out for the first time. I don't know if it will pass the boot screen. Yes, it passed. So you could see it has booted up and let's just allow the screen. Let's go into settings about phone and boom you could see experience kernel xdk18 so uh, let's just try the functions let me see if it works in build no, it doesn't work. So let me just show you the functions. For this, you have to download Trickster Mod, uh, which is available for free on the Play Store. Let me show you. it's free and just go to the app and go to specific uh, side and from left and go to uh, screen rate control oh oops screen rate control and you could see you can just double tap to wake you and double tap to sleep so let me show you actually works you could see it works pretty really fine and there are many more functions you can use uh, your um, phone keyboard 
as a wireless keyboard for your computer or any other device so that's pretty good uh, you should download some app for that uh, so uh, this was it for the video guys thanks for watching my video and uh, you could install this ROM I'll be doing a second review for this ROM about the battery backup and all the features explained thanks for watching